yesterday a customer I love it when they see that there's no tea in it and then they say hey are you out of tea did you notice that we don't have any tea in there and you want to ask me if I have tea because I just carry around tea with me what up dudes I am on the way to seven my boss just got to work and I tried calling him while he was on the way to work so I could ask him if he could pick us up some drinks from Nunkin because I was almost done with my drink but he didn't answer his phone, so now I'm on the way to Seven Brew right now. And yeah, we're just gonna get a drink. Um, work is going fine. Nothing really been happening. I cooked a lot of food to make sure people got foods today. And yeah, I've been listening to Charlie XCX a lot. She's brilliant, spectacular. Um, I already listened to her, but I'm listening to her new album. Um, I like it. It's very boppy. She's brilliant, spectacular queen, bitch. That girl, she's it. She is the moment. She is. She's beauty, she's grace, um, period. Anyway, I'm going now, I'm going to the Seven Brew. Okay guys, so I went to the Seven Brew here because the Duncan that's right next door, literally like right next door, um, they are, their cold brew is, it's like super, super strong. Like I just really can't be, it's so dark that it's like, I don't know, like it's good when certain people make it, but it's so hit or miss that I don't even go and get my coffee there. Like I get my coffee, in the town where I live and I'm in a different town where I work. So anyway, I wanted to try this place because my boss wanted to try something and he's already kind of like not that big of a believer in Duncan. So I was like, you know what, we'll go, we'll get him something from Seven Brew. He's never tried Seven Brew and it looks super freaking good. Like I wanna, I wanna try it, oh my God. But anyway, yeah, I'm on my way back to work now. That was actually really quick. I told myself I wasn't gonna go there if the line was long but it actually didn't have a line today so but i went there because i thought i was gonna get a free drink because i've been getting free drinks to people for no reason but um yeah they weren't doing that today so i didn't get a free drink whatever win some you lose some payday is tomorrow so tomorrow night what up dudes i didn't record myself at work today because i just wanted to take a breaky break from recording for a minute i just needed some time to like edit some videos and get them on my phone before i record anything else because i'm gonna run out of storage but i wanted to show you this traffic jam that i literally am in it's every day every day and i just want to say shout out to the people who understand that my videos are raw and real like i literally i keep certain things in there so that way y'all can see like this is legit my life like you know what I mean like I'm not trying to edit everything and make it completely like oh my life is perfect because it's not perfect it's not perfect me and Carter bump heads every freaking day every day I was supposed to go to an interview today at 4 p.m but this is happening right now so I'm not gonna be able to because I really want a second job so that way I can get everything caught up because you know having rent right now my car payment has been behind like really really behind like every day i'm like are they gonna come get this damn car and i even called them because they left a, a notice on my door that was like to call them so i called the car place and i'm like hey when are you gonna come get this thing because i'm tired of living my life on the edge and they were like we can't tell you when um it's just gonna happen whenever it happens and i was like well that's always fun the element of surprise but um yeah basically they asked me if i had money and i was like i don't have it and so um yeah, I just been looking at my life on the edge and I wanted a second job so I could try to, you know, get everything caught up. But for some reason, the universe doesn't want me to have a second job. Okay, it really doesn't because every time I put my interviews right after work, I always end up getting stuck in traffic. It's freaking stupid. There's no way. Like, anyway, so I'm not going to be able to make it and I'm starting to think that the cars are against me and I don't need a second job something is gonna happen i did call the guy uh the guy that was supposed to interview me and tell him you know that i wasn't gonna be able to make it but he's doing a lot of interviews today they're having a lot of interviews so um i wanted to let him know that i wasn't gonna be able to be there because i didn't want to leave a bad taste in his mouth of me because i am a really usually i am a very reliable person 
but because of the traffic instances in the town that I live in and that's what causes my downfall so but yeah anyways I just wanted to make sure y'all aware that I'm a real ass bitch okay like I I want y'all to see the bad sides of me yeah I don't like all the freaking angles and stuff that I be doing when I'm shooting it for up here that is so unflattering but I do that because honestly that's what I look like if, if you were to see me in person you would probably be like <clears throat> Brother, uh, what's that? What's that, brother? Like, not as surprised because you've seen all my angles already. You know what I'm saying? So I don't want to freaking be putting out some kind of filtered content where everything looks perfect and I'm just following trends and just doing whatever's trendy. Like, I want y'all to see me because I'm being real. Because I'm being a real person. So I hope you guys appreciate that and I'll see y'all whenever I do stuff. Okay guys, I didn't really record when I got home because I was just tired and grumpy and hungry and in a bad mood. But anyways, me and Mike are as Zach right now. It is huge in here. Not right now. Guys, in here. Have, like, yep, I do get moody. I'm a cancer, okay? I have all of them. I feel it. I feel everything. I'm emotional wreck. They got a Mr. Beast meal. Look at that. Yeah, I'm just sensitive little wreck. Mr. Beast. I'll show y'all later, but I love this sign. It says enjoy. I always say enjoy. I'm like a Coke baby. Enjoy. I'm being enjoy. Uh, <laughs> I know guys, I'm a dork. But guys, it's a big like surface over here. It is. It's really big in here. Yeah. Compared to the other Zaxby's, the other Zaxby's is small. Yeah, and I don't really like the other Zaxby's because it was so small. Look you. It was so small. You're the cutest. It's busy. What do you mean it's busy? You know, it's getting real busy around here at night. The apartments? Oh, uh, yeah. Why? All right, tell me, first off, the people downstairs well, with the two girls, they're moving out right now. They're gone. They're what fine. do you mean the two girls? You know, the Lily, uh, they came over on her birthday. Oh, them. Yeah, the older girl. So they are moving out? Yeah, they were moving all their shit out. Dang. All their shit out in that U-Haul. They're, they're hopping in right now and leaving. And then, uh, that, so I, I, that's why I was down there so long. I was busy watching everything. And then there's just people just walking, coming up and down the stairs, telling me why the apartment right here, mm -hmm. with all the fucking people, mm -hmm. moving another motherfucker in. There was a fucking person with a fucking suitcase and a backpack. With that fucking girl with the blue hair walking up the stairs. Dang, dude. That's what I'm oh, saying. Yeah. It gets busy. People storming out of this fucking stairs down the stairs. Fucking like they're angry. Oh, all, all sorts of fucking dude. dude. Yeah, I'm literally mad. They're they're loud. Wait, wait, wait. wait That's wait. why I'm ready to get out of here too. Like, oh, yeah, fuck yeah. I, I, I was I was gonna talk, try and talk to those fucking people, but they were both. Dumb fucking. But Lily. Couches, they were fucking. Lily, they got all that shit in there. Lily Yen is moving? Yeah, yeah, that, them girls move, are moving tonight. That's what they've been doing the past, like, week. It's just. No, I was wondering why that apartment. patio was, like, getting empty. They, they were just fixing the apartment, cleaning it and shit. Slowly moving out, yeah. It gets busy. There's a lot of people walking around. I don't want them around. to move. What? I don't want them to move. You don't even talk to them. And plus, you're not even allowed to play with kids. So it don't matter. But yeah, it's busy around here, man. That's weird. Because it's yeah. literally summer. Well, you didn't see anything good, though. That was it. Just them moving and those people coming in and out of that apartment. Yeah, the good show is them fucking moving in another motherfucker. How the fuck are they fitting all these fucking people? That's what I'm saying, dude. They're all probably teenage college kids. And they all split the rent. And if they're all dating somebody and there's a three-bedroom in there and there's three of them dating somebody, then that means there's six to... three-bedroom, I figured it was just like this. 